Now guys, I had a lot of people telling me I need to use the Renetti pistol in Modern Warfare 3 zombies. And I'm like, what? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Guys, man, I don't even use pistols in, in multiplayer, zombies, or nothing. I, I just don't see the point using a secondary weapon. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just try it out. And let's just put this thing through the paces in these tier 3 Dark Ether streets. Let's see if they were right. Let's go. <laughs> Alright guys, let's try to wrap this video up to at least 100 likes, so no cap. Stop the cap. I actually thought you guys were capping, man. I'm not even gonna lie, but I'm just like, everybody's saying in the comment sections, all my videos, like, yo, use the Renetti pistol. How come you're not using the Renetti pistol? I had no idea about the Renetti pistol, number one. And number two, like I said earlier, I don't use pistols in the game. I use LMG's assault rifle. You know what I'm saying? Marksmanship rifles, man. You know, the SMGs and that kind of stuff. And I'm like, a pistol? Why the, why am I gonna use a pistol, man? This shit ain't got no no power, no, you know what I'm saying? A pistol, a Renetti pistol. The multiplayer, maybe, yeah, but I'm just like, let me try it out, man. I'm gonna tell you this. This thing shred. Yo, yo, they was not capping, fam. This thing shreds like nobody's business. Damn! This thing is shredding, bruh. Alright, so I know you're looking at this camo and it's like, yo, why is that turning red the more you shoot? Guys, man, this blueprint, number one, I didn't even know I had unlocked. I must have unlocked it organically somehow, maybe in multiplayer or maybe just doing a con, maybe doing the story mode or something like that. Maybe that's how I leveled the gun up. I, like, I don't even know, but I was looking for the Renetti. I found it and I saw it had some blueprints unlocked. I was like, yo, I like this camel that the shit turns red the more you shoot. And the shit turns full red when the clip is empty. I'm like, yo, that's what's up. Let me equip that thing and let me see what's popping. And yeah, man, so I like the camo. It's called Heat Stroke. <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, what the? Yo, the name of the blueprint is Heat Stroke, man. So I'm like, you know what? Let's give these zombies a Heat Stroke and give them a business. And that's what this thing is. That's what this thing is doing, man. So, yeah. Um, didn't know about this camera. You you guys may have this unlocked as well. So, y'all seen how quick this thing took out that Decipher Bounty, which, as you guys know, sometimes can be a challenge, man. And it took it out with the quickness, man. With the quickness. And then this regular random straggle daggle Decipher just sitting here in these Tier 3 streets. Got them done easy, man. So, I like the Renetti and the fact that it's high fire rate man for the pistol it's, i think it's what is a three round burst it might be more than that maybe like a four or five i gotta go back and check man but this thing is absolutely shredding in these tier three i can't wait to see what it does in these in these dark ether streets you know what i'm saying so even doing contracts in tier three not just bounty contracts but for example this outlast pnd contract absolute breeze man this whole this whole time in tier three Matter of fact, with this Renetti, it's been an absolute breeze, man. You know what I'm saying? Even if random, no stress, you know what I'm saying? Bounty contracts, not even worry about them. Uh, this contract right here, Outlast, like I said, super duper easy. I mean, just quick, quickly aiming down the sights, pistol wise, is up there really fast, you know what I'm saying? And it's like, yo, you moving so fast, it's like, because, you know, LMGs and some heavy assault rifles, they kind of almost weigh you down. You know what I'm saying? You really got to put some good attachments on there to up your movement speed and aim down sight speed and all that, man. But not with this. Not with this at all, man. This thing is an absolute breeze, man. And I was kind of nervous. I ain't gonna, I'm not even going to lie to you guys, man. I was a little, like, hesitant at first. I was a little nervous at first when I was at the loadout trying to decide what secondary weapon. I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna equip this as a, as my main gun. No secondary, except for the Scorcher, of course. You know what I'm saying? But as far as like a weapon, weapon, man, I made the right decision, man. I think these guys are onto something, but I'm still kind of nervous about these Dark Eater streets. All right, guys, man, we made it to these Dark Eater streets, man. Solo, dolo, kind of Scorcher this time, though. You know what I'm saying, guys, man? So let's just kick it off with the Outlast. I just usually go for this one first, man. Y'all already know what I be doing out here, man. I go for this one first. It's right here. Boom, we're going to knock it out. 
I'm still a little hesitant, man. I don't know why. Well, actually, I do know why, man. Yeah, I know it did good in Tier 3, but it's kind of like, yeah, man, but this is this is Dark Ether Streets, man. This is a whole nother level. These, these zombies are, these zombies be on 100. You know what I'm saying? I'm just like, let's just, let's just see, man. I hope it does good, because I ain't got no other weapon, bro. This is all I have right here. I have the, you know what I'm saying? I have, the, I have this heat stroke, the Renetti pistol, you know what I'm saying? And my Scorcher, and my Ether Blade. I ain't gonna lie, yeah, I got my... I got the Ethan Blade too, which I ain't gonna lie, man. If you do use like pistols and stuff, yo, do y'all use like Ethan Blades or like or you use like if you don't have a sword, you use like a, a primary, a secondary weapon as well, like a assault rifle, or, like an SMG. I don't know. Let me know, man. I mean, I feel comfortable right now, even in the dark in the streets. I ain't gonna lie, cause this thing, this thing is taking out those mimics, like. Uh, it's just shredding mimics. It's just it's shredding everything, man. The little manglers, you know what I'm saying? Look at this mimic right here. Boom. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Okay, I mean I do got sentry guns out, but them sentry guns is busy as hell. You know what I'm saying? Look at the look at the mimic, bro. Just damn. Just shredding the freaking mimic, bro. I ain't gonna lie, man. This 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 pistol surprised the hell out of me. In both of these areas, man, the tier three and the dark ether streets, man. I was like, ain't no way, man. A pistol? Man, I just knew these guys in the comment sections was, was capping. I was like, man, use the Renetti, use the pistol. I'm just like, use the pistol. Yo, if I use this pistol and, you know what I'm saying, it doesn't do well and I die multiple times, yo, man, I'm kicking y'all off the YouTube channel. I'm just playing. <laughs> yo, I'm just playing, man. But yeah, let's see what we got. Yo, not bad, man. Two PAP 3s and a PAP 2 self revive kit, man. And how about I miss my freaking bunny? Alright, let's try this again, man. Let's try this again. How I miss the whole top of the crane when I had plenty of time to get to it. You know what? Never mind. Let's not even get into it, man. Let's just go ahead and, and do the sport control contract, man. Here we go, man. This is the one I used to dread all the time. I keep saying that, man, but guys, I'm telling you, man, if you keep doing this, you're going to be all right, man. I'm going to say this right now, too, man. Would you look at this? It's like every time I do come to this more control contract, it's like, and I'm sure you guys feel the same way, right? Like you got so much loot, especially if you solo or maybe if you just have one other person in your team or maybe two other people. It's like three of y'all, right? And everybody, you know what I'm saying? Like you, if you solo, you got to get all three of these damn things. Or, or, yeah, all three of them. You know what I'm saying? How come they couldn't make the rucksack bigger, man? Some more slots to the rucksack. Or am I tripping? I mean, I like that we got, you know, 30 slots for the stash. You know what I'm saying? Stash increase. But you would think because of that, you know what I'm saying? If you would think that, hey, let's just go ahead and increase the, the rucksack size as well. Because it's like, if you increase the stash... You pretty much have more items in your stash that you can potentially want to put in your rut to go play the game. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, yo, how come they could have add like another two slots? You know, because whenever I do this sport control, just like right then, I had to make a decision. I'm like, okay, shit. I mean, I want to put all of these in my rucksack at one time, so I got to keep going back and forth. You know what I'm saying? But... Guess what I noticed though, guys? If you got the grenade bandolier, as you can see what's happening right now, it's actually giving me free bandoliers. Or not free, but it's basically making, you know what I'm saying? It's making more of those inhibitors. And it's like, and it's not too slow neither. It's actually pretty quick, in my opinion. Like, it's. It's actually kind of fast. It seems like it's making them faster than it's making like any. Look at this, bro. How he knocked me down and he knocked me down again. I'm like, I was so freaking pissed right there. All right, anyways, man. But yeah, so now I had to go all the way back around just because he want to show off in front of his zombie friend. You know what? The hell with you. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm just like, how come they could make the stash? I mean, the rucksack bigger. You know what I'm saying? That's like, you always gotta make a decision. Oh man, what can I do without? Cause I don't wanna sit here and go back and forth, but yo, the bandolier joint? 
Yo, man. I be trying to add that to my rucksack every freaking game if I could. <laughs> and this... Alright, now this kind of sucks, man. Some purple tools, and I did... What was that? Golden tool? Alright. Not, not a bad run, guys, man. You know? Not a, not a bad run. Alright, guys. So the Renetti loadout right here. Now, this is the heat stroke, but you can build this as long as you equip the Renetti. So, 9mm overpressured, 50 round drum, Bruin Express trigger action, Bruin assault grip right there for the rear grip, f tack folding stock, man, for the stock, and you're gonna do good, man. Like I said, I love this camo, but if you don't have that blueprint, um, then obviously just equip the same attachments to the gun, and you'll be fine, man. So, yeah, man, y'all, that's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it, man. If you use the Renetti, let me know what you think about it in the comment section, man. You like it, you don't like it, you don't like pistols like me for the most part or whatever it is, man. But yeah, uh, subscribe if you guys are new. And if you're looking for the video on some more secrets of uh, the new Dark Ether, check this video right here. I'm going to catch you guys on the next video.